but we have an amazing power to make a difference and, and, and help others live their lives in purpose and happiness. If only we can depart from the idea that, that the actions of one man or one woman are futile. I want to share with you three lessons I've learned over the years that have, that have helped me both professionally and personally. First, take care of your personal life and find someone you love passionately to share your life with. Second, take care of the people around you, especially those that don't have the means to pay you back, because it, it is only when we expect nothing in return that we're truly giving. Third, Regardless of how many times we have been broken down or up, personally or professionally, don't give up your dreams. And open up your heart and let the universe, God, Allah, send you good people and good karma. Because as, as St. Francis of Assisi wrote, it is in giving that we, that we receive and in pardoning that we are pardoned. I want to close tonight with a story of an orphanage I visited in, in Iran, my country of birth, in 1997. I was there during the noon hour, where lunch was being served. Their meal was an orange, a single solitary orange. And to see the look on these people's faces, kids from the age of five through their 20s, and the way they savored uh, every bite and cherished every moment, rejuvenated my sense of philanthropy. That is when I realized there's too much poverty in this world for us to sit on the sidelines. Here we are in the, in the richest nation on earth where we, we on, a, on average, throw away over 200 pounds of food per person per year, while others find themselves lucky enough to have an orange for lunch. So you can be that single person that makes all the difference in someone else's world. Because what it comes down to is this. When we are sitting on our deathbed, what would matter the most is not how hard we worked or how hard we played, but rather how many people's lives we touched in a positive way. We must do what we can to make a difference, and we must do it today, because we are not promised tomorrow. Thank you, and good night.